Good morning, dear children. How are you all? Yes, you all are excellent and safe at home. Today we will see our English from the book Moments. Which lesson? A house is not at a home. A house is not a home. Written by by Zan Gaudiasio. Okay, Zan Gaudio Gaudiasio. Written by uh, Zan Gaudiasio. It's very good. And teenagers, boy like you, like your age, the story is about that boy. How many characters are here, you, dear children? You know, only three characters are there. Those characters, one is uh, writer. Here, the writer itself, this writer, he is narrating, narrating this story. So, he is a writer, one sketch, the other is a pet cat. You know, he had, uh, he had a pet cat and the other one is the stranger. Only three characters, the main characters are these three characters. This teenager, this teenager means here wherever I have written teenager means uh, the author itself. Okay, Zan Gaudicio. And uh, the teenager is a high school student. He joins his new school. Okay, and uh, misses his uh, miss. He misses his old school. Okay. And teachers and his classmates also, friends also. Pet cat. Uh, the pet cat is a very dear to teenager. She is a red colored cat. And the other one is a stranger. Who is that stranger? Stranger lives a mile away not far away mile away from the teenager she is a very helpful and she takes care of his pet cat finds out the details of owner and uh, gives uh, his teenager's cat back to him only the three characters are here you know dear children what is the title of this lesson a uh, house is what is the difference between house and home Yes, house, house is a four walls, okay, and home, there we, the family members stay together, live together, happily, shares our happiness, shares our problems, shares our, everything, that is called a uh, house, this, it, it, the title itself saying, a home is a place, okay where one gets comfort home that's why we always see the board you know in few people's house that home sweet home not house sweet house home sweet home these four walls only the building is called house but the people when they stay there and they live together share together all the things that is called and when we come to our home we feel very comfort wherever you go you know for any luxurious place you go but after a few days we miss our home let, uh, let it be doesn't matter whether it is very luxurious or whether it is a small house or whether it is a cottage but we miss a house so that that miss a home so a home is a place where one gets comfort coziness and the joy the joy of longings one and find the true happiness that is very important happiness and comfort within the premises we feel very comfort in our own home so that is the story a house is not a home they got house but there was no uh, happiness no nothing is there you know so not coziness also not comfort is not there so the writer and the narrator and the teenager these three are the same means this Zan Gaudesio is a teenager in this story he is narrating his story in this lesson okay now what is the story what is the theme of a story the theme of a story in this story a house is not a home the author tells us to encounter the challenges 
challenges and problems of our life boldly dear children challenges come everyone in everyone's life if there is no challenges in our life there is no happiness in our life when we face challenges boldly that is called you know that happiness when we are uh, overcome that challenges the happiness which we get that is really we can't express that so in everybody's life challenges must be there and in the challenges time not to give up but face the challenges boldly that is a true life okay so here the uh, narrator uh, writer is telling the same thing the author tells us to encounter the challenges and problems of our life boldly the author faced which problem uh, he faced the author faced many difficulties because his house caught fire his house caught fire and everything burnt he had no good clothes to wear no house to live in his cat he had a cat his cat also was also missing he felt very depressed sometimes it happens like this in our life we feel nobody is with us and we feel lonely even though in the crowd also we feel lonely why because this when something happens with us so he also felt depressed but later on his classmates helped him with everything and he found his life when he got his friend circles and then after few days he thought that no i was wrong i got my life again back and uh, with everything and he found life and will to live this is the challenges how the narrator narrator was only like you teenager boy okay na teenager boy and just he had uh, left his one school you know in one school the 11 12th or uh, that we have to do in other school okay up to the uh, 10th standard one school and sometimes up to the 8th standard the one school is there then the 8 9 10th 11 12th the other school in this way in the teen age he the teenager boy left his old school and taken admission in the new school what we are going to be seen in this lesson see the summary of the chapter what we are going to be seen the teenager joins a new school teenager's house catches fire they shift to grandparents house teenager goes to school teenager revisits the house teenager schoolmates helps the teenager the teenager finds his cats you know dear children let me talk before i tell you the summary of this lesson in this lesson a house is not home really facing the challenges in your life you might have observed uh, face the challenges challenges not the big challenges but one or uh, other challenges we face that time we face we feel very depressed but dear children we you should not you must not we must not feel depressed because this challenges one or other day goes like when the night comes everywhere dark we see but after few hours after the darkness there the light comes so the same happens in our life when the challenges come when the problem comes problems comes in our life that we feel but if you go if you pass that challenges very boldly with confident that no so definitely one day you will see the light after that darkness okay so here we will see in this lesson the teenager joins a new school the teenager 
uh, writer of this school. See, before it catches, what is the second one that a teenager's house catches fire? Before his house catches fire, he has shifted from old school to new school. And when he has taken admission in the new school, he felt very lonely there. Because new teachers, new school, new, uh, uh, new friend circles, there he was feeling very loneliness. So he always dismissed his old school. And every time, even though he has taken admission in the new school, he always visits his new uh, old school, old teachers and new old friend circles also. And what once what happened, he was sitting in his room and all of a sudden he saw, um, he saw the uh, smoke from his ceiling, ceiling, the top side. And he was sitting on his dining table and when he saw everywhere smoke, then he, uh, he understood that he now my house is uh, caught in fire. So there, his mother also came and both of them, you know, they have come, they came outside. Very hurriedly they have come outside. And then his mother remember uh, the important documents they have taken and they came out. Then his mother all of a sudden remembers that yes, my one important thing is there inside house. So she did not care the fire and she directly went inside. Then teenager come to know that because when he was very small, his father expired. Okay, so all the photocopies, all the letters and all the important, only that was the thing that she can remember her husband. So she went inside to collect the photos and the letters, few documents uh, of uh, his uh, father. Then he shouted, mom, why you went there? Then he realized the mo love, mother's love. He was shouting and screaming and told the parents to call the uh, fire brigade, fire extinguisher. And she went. He was really very much uh, scared. In other days, sometimes he gives the back answer to his mother. He was not loving that much because their normal mother. But now, when she was in pain, when she in uh, in she was struggling to take that, he understood the love of mother, and he was screaming. He shouted. Adds by that time the fire extinguisher come the fire brigade vehicle come and she anyhow she took all the documents and the photo and came out but by that time she has come out she was fainted because complete that smoke she has taken and because of smoke she fainted but as soon as she has come out this teenager boy hugged her mother उसने अपने मम्मी को क्या कर दिया अपने गले लगाया ही अंडरस्टूड दैट द लव ऑफ मदर बिकॉज इन दैट हाउस ओनली दिस टू पीपल मदर एंड दिज सन हर सन ओनली टू पीपल दे यूज टू स्टे देयर एंड आफ्टर दैट वॉट हैपन्स देन द टीन एज इज डूइंग इज होमवर्क दैट टाइम दिस कैच इज फायर ही एंड हिज मदर रन आउटसाइड वेरी फास्टली ही गोज टू हिज नेबर्स टू कॉल द फायर ब्रिगेड एंड वाइल हिज मदर रशेज इन साइड टू गेट सम इम्पॉर्टेंट डॉक्यूमेंट्स एंड द पिक्चर्स ऑफ हिज father he is terrified on seeing his mother go inside see here and the burning house and the in the process of saving his mother forgets about his pet cat you know the teenager has had one pet cat but his mother went he forget about his teenager that the pet cat what is that then when their house catches fire there is no uh, then after five hours the fire extinguisher they could uh, 
do all the things by that time they all the house completely turn into ashes everything burn whatever was there inside everything burn and it turn into ashes there is no way that's why they had shifted to they, they had shifted to grandparents house for few days they shifted to their grandparents house after five hours you know the fireman are success in extinguishing fire the teenager suddenly realized that his pet cat is missing okay he searches it everywhere but unable to find it he cries for the loss of his cat he and his mother shift to his grandparents house what is that after that the teenager then teenager goes to school as even uh, before the uh, they caught you know, house caught fire uh, so before that only he had taken admission so he started to go to school there is no bag no proper dress no shoes no proper uniform still you know like zombie zombie you know zombies their appearance and everything is very awkward to see so in that in that situation he used to go to school so he started go to school and when he go to went to school he found that you know all are looking like at him like a zombie aliens okay then the next day the teenager goes to school his clothes took weird 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 and he does not have any books as everything burnt in the house okay that house completely burnt books or no school bag everything was destroyed in the fire he feels strange going like he like this to school and wants to die there he felt depressed that is the challenge he had faced no school means no dress to wear no uniform feeling lonely and the very dear one is his pet cat that is also missing so he felt like now let me die i cannot face all these problems in the teen age he faced and he felt that no i don't want to leave now i want to die so as his old schools his friends his house and his pet cat have been taken away from him dear children in our life many times it happens our dear and near ones leave from us they go from us far away that time we feel lonely that is very challenges in this situation we have to face this challenge boldly one or other day definitely we get the victory and then if the challenges are not there dear children what is the use of that life when we will get then happiness yes no so challenges must be there in our life and that we must face very boldly as this teenager has faced and at last in the he got a new life understand so what is that then teenager revisits the house teenager always go to that uh, house he had something in his mind if i go there i will get my pet cat okay so he always revisits there after the school he always go to that house and after his grandparents they have shifted to new apartment their own means new apartment they shifted there and when after the school he used to always visit uh, his new uh, his burnt house After school the teenager revisits his house and finds that damage due to the fire in huge his heart misses his cat and he is unable to find he tried his level best to find it you know he had tied one um, phone number on its neck also 
if it goes also anywhere misses by mistake so the pe uh, people those who find it they can see the number and call it back but what happened that phone number was there on in its neck that cat's neck but phone also burned in that house so nobody could call uh, him okay so now his heart misses his cat and he is unable to find it he visits the house every now and then in the hope of finding his cat but it seems to be nowhere he tried his level best but he couldn't find his cat okay then schoolmates helps the teenager then he always go to school every day but there also he always feel skip very but after you know few days his friend circles all his teachers and they they come to know that why he is coming like this because his house caught fire uh, and burnt in the fire so they helped him okay schoolmates helped the teenager how they helped him so by giving the new school bag the new gym cat and every you know kit gym kit and all the shoes socks then he felt that no here also i have good friend circles like my old school what happens you know the school helps the teenager the news about the destruction about his the destruction of house spreads in his new school everybody in the school becomes aware of his condition then his schoolmates help him by giving him school supplies notebooks and clothes as well the students introduce themselves to him and invite him to come to their home okay his incident helps him open up to them and thus he makes a new friend when these new friend circles helped him by giving him new notebooks new school bag new uniform everything he felt no this friends are also good for me then what is the last one school mates help the teenager find sees cats the teenager finds his cats so he how he found always after the school he used to go there revisit that burnt house in hoping that one or other day i will get my miss cat okay then once as usual he went to revisit the school then one day while he was watching rebuilding of his house a lady comes the you know i had told you the three characters one is a teenager boy the second is a pet cat and the third one character was a stranger that that stranger is a lady stranger very kind helpful stranger so one day while he is watching the rebuilding of his house a lady comes and ask him if the cat she is carrying was his he is overjoyed when he sees that she is carrying her his cat his pet cat he takes it from her arm and holds her close to him as if he got a new life he was overwhelming you know overjoyed when he uh, sees its cat pet cat life his new friend and and arms and holds close to him and cries cry that is uh, oh happiness you know that when we uh, sometimes we cry uh, cry that sometimes when we feel very happy that time also we cry cries he feels grateful for his life his new friends the kindness of a stranger and a beloved cat he felt very good about that strange lady also okay and uh, that he got his pet cat so here is the summary summary how he has faced the challenges boldly and at last he got a new life 
one situation was there he was feeling now i don't want because my pet cut me and my house is not there i don't have anything to wear no bag no everything to go to school he was thinking that but after he he did not give up then he he got very good friend circles the new teachers also got and one day he got its his cat also so he was very happy in this way he overcome his challenges and he got victory in that yes no so here the comparison what is the comparison the contrast the author's life before and after the fire incident what was that the the author was leading a peaceful life he was leading before see before uh, when the uh, after the fire incidents what happened before and after before he was living very peaceful life before fire broke out in his house he was a bit of dis disappointment for his missing his old school only because he had taken admission in a new school friends and teacher he was trying to be normal with everything before the incident fire catches his house he was he has taken admission and after that but only he was missing his old friends and uh, old teachers also so he was disappointed okay and he was trying to be normal with everything in his life at his very this very moment the fire broke out then after the fire what happened before the fire had broken out his house the author had joined a new house school just now the author felt very lonely as his closest friend were sent to a different high school he used to miss his old school teachers and friends and went to meet his teachers regularly he used to go to meet them very regularly after the fire incident the author was completely destroyed devastated and the loss of his belongings his pet cat added to the misery of joining okay and a new school he felt no inclination to go to new his new school and at one point what happened at one point of time wanted to die he missed his pet cat very much and used to go to the place where his house once stood to search for her okay and what is the as i said that a house is not a home a house is not a home what is that the justify how you will justify this title a house is a, a beginning of the lesson i told house four walls home there we get the happiness the comfort the coziness and relaxation that is that you have to justify if in the uh, this question comes in the exam you have to write how you will justify this lesson so uh, title a house is not a home is a uh, relation to the story in the story the author's house gets completely destroyed in a fire due to this he and his mother had no take refuge at his grandparents home and later in a rented apartment then they went to stay in a rented apartment the places where the author lived after the fire incident can be called cannot be called a home that was a home but after the fire that home was not a home okay and a home is the place where one gets comfort the coziness and the joy of our longings okay of longings one can find the true happiness and comfort within the premises of a home our own home on the other hand a house is without these sentiments and emotion house is just a confined place up 
made up of all four vials it can be never be made to home this is okay they were merely places where they hit they took sh shape in this way you can justify in the home we, we get all these things but in the house only the four walls here this nice story the small story summary i have told you in the next lecture we will see the detailed explanation one by one paragraph wise explanation in the next lecture read this lesson once again try to understand this story thank you and have a nice day